hey you guys welcome back to my channel pisces soul tribe what's going on you guys um hopefully this message finds you in good favor and that you are doing well on your journey and if you feel you aren't of course my intention is to grab a word from the divine to help inspire you to continue to move forward on your journey pisces soul tribe i want to get into a general read for you and of course anything you need from me can be found down below in the description box so what's going on you guys um first of all i want to thank you guys so much for the likes the comments f for sharing um subscribing new subscribers like what's up um i hope hope hopefully you all are ready for a wild crazy enjoyable abundant um fulfilling ride like we going places y'all i can feel it in the energy okay so today i'm gonna keep it real simple um i already have our in your dreams oracle manifestation um card here okay um i'm gonna get into some tarot but i'm gonna do it a little different today um we'll see what your current energy is looking like you know those energies outside of yourself external you know surrounding you possibly um as well as any other possible income or um possible outcomes or even challenges okay so for the in your dreams um oracle card we have the number two I'm definitely, um, once again, seeing more music. I'm seeing, um, of course, a pianist. Okay. Uh, for some reason, I'm also hearing um, Alicia Keys, uh, specifically songs in a minor. Okay. Somebody probably sings in a minor key. Okay. Definitely feel some form of artist here as well. M many different artists. Artistry, creativity. I definitely also am feeling some form of a magician energy, um, some form of manifestation. Maybe becoming an artist is some form of purpose for you, something you're also wanting to do. I'm also seeing very strong changes um, being significant um, in your energy as well. I'm also feeling nine of pentacles, um, queen of pentacles, as well as empress type of energy as well. Definitely some form um, of grounding here. Okay. Uh, okay, but let's put that down. Okay. Today I'm going to use the Luma. Okay. Take a deeper dive. Uh, maybe get some more clarity on things surrounding you. Okay, spirit. Can I have Pisces current energy? Just Pisces. Okay. No external sources unless absolutely necessary. So currently you're in um, this Six of Swords um, energy, Pisces. Um, peaceful endings is also what I'm hearing. Ten of Swords as well. Okay. Definitely strong endings. Um, definitely strong completions as well. I feel like cycles have come to an end here. Uh, I feel like you're moving forward to spaces of peace. Um, grounding, um, possibly abundance as well. But definitely peace is your main focus right now. Some form of mental peace as well. Spirit, can I? Mm, King of coins. Definitely some abundant energy um, incoming for you, Pisces. Very much um, Knight of Swords, you know. Definitely getting Knight of Swords. The imagery I'm getting is um, definitely from the Light Seers deck. Particularly when the when the um, Knight of Swords is running towards the motorcycle or, you know, with the um, with the bird flying in the air, almost as if you're ready to set off off on some adventure, somewhat fearless as well. OK. OK. Six of Swords. I see you. I see you, Pisces. OK. Spirit energy surrounding Pisces. So I'm going to take them both. So the Hierophant as well as the Four of Coins. Mm. I feel like some form of commitment was held back to, um, from you Definitely feels like it's coming from the divine Definitely feels like it's coming from on high I'm also getting um, the moon energy here as well Something was definitely hidden um, from, from you for uh, just a period of time And like I feel like because of the space that you're moving towards now uh, With this energy surrounding you um, This is something you're able to move into now um, there is room available is also what 
what I'm hearing? At first, there was no vacancies. This energy was um, resting around you vacant. I'm um, hoping for some vacancy, okay? This energy was definitely meant specific to you because this is the type of energy from what I'm feeling and hearing. Um, it wouldn't go anywhere else because it wasn't it wouldn't resonate anywhere else. OK. Any challenges, spirit? Mm hmm. Uh, six of coins as well as the justice. Wow. <laughs> I'm wondering why that's a challenge. Because that's, that's, I mean, that's very special. I mean, this could be possible that this is um, something that you're getting ready to receive. Some sort of truth, some sort of information. I feel like there's something you are about to hear about. But this is definitely some form of, of equal give and take. I feel like this is something that's um, meant to come into balance. I mean, we do have the six of coins as well as the justice. So some form of balance is definitely significant um, with that. Um, we'll definitely highlight that. But I'm still wondering why it's a challenge. Possible outcome. So the strength, okay? So the strength. I feel like somebody is definitely going to be motivated. Somebody here is definitely going to be inspired. I'm actually excited that there is no other energy right now, just the spirit. You know, that's why I love the divine. The divine gives you just what you ask for, sometimes even more. Um, there's definitely peace here. I'm definitely feel, feeling a solid foundation of peace, Okay. But there's also something here about you just letting things flow, allowing things to enter in. And as they enter in, they take out what you don't need is also what I'm feeling. OK, six of coins, um, not six of coins, hmm. six of swords. Yeah, so the empress, the lovers. Hmm. Eight of Wands as well as the Seven of Wands. Hmm. In this present time, Pisces, you have some very solid boundaries. You have really, truly nurtured yourself. I feel like you chose to protect yourself. I feel like at this present time, you are in a mode, in a mode of protecting yourself. There's definitely some form of security. Like, I finally feel like somebody realizes their real true potential. Somebody really truly realizes also the power that you possess as well. I feel like you are choosing to just move ahead, forge ahead. But, like, I feel like you're also in some sense um, determined. Uh, I feel like you're determined to reach some type of goal. Okay. What else, Spirit? You got a lot of cards flipping out for you. So, Eight of Coins, Two of Swords, King of Wands. Pisces, this is some really interesting energy. Uh, I feel like you are somewhat a master of illusion. I feel like through a lot of experiences, you've changed over time. Um, at this present moment, I feel like you're also being viewed as somebody who is a, a real go getter. I feel like when you set off to do something, definitely feeling Ace of Wands energy. Um, when you set off to do something, you accomplish it. But not only do you accomplish it, you make it look good. You make it look easy is also what I'm hearing. Definitely with this Eight of Coins to the Two of Swords to this King of Wands. I feel like you just made a decision to go after what you wanted to go after. Um, definitely seems like some form of conquest. That There's something that you're trying to conquer. Um, some type of territory. Some type of um, gifting. Um, also some form of foundation is also what I'm feeling um, with this. But like I feel like with you and this King of Wands um, energy, this is definitely um, notating you as somebody who is a go-getter. And you're looking pretty damn good, okay? 
So, uh, Spirit, what's this for coins and the Hierophant? Why is this in the energy surrounding? Okay. So, Ten of Cups. This is something that definitely feels like it's meant to put you in a space of total happiness. I feel like you've been through a lot enough is what I'm feeling for this. I feel like now is the time to be happy. I also feel like something is definitely coming in to, bal to balance you out. Um, I'm definitely feeling some form of community. I feel like some some form of community, um, groups of people, individuals that you may possibly um, connect yourself to um, if you haven't already in the near future. These are going to be people who are going to lift you up. I feel like these are people who, who are going to motivate you. They're going to um, inspire you. Like they're going to inspire you with the inspiration that you have within. It's almost like a spark. Someone's going to ignite a flame is also what I'm feeling. Okay. And it's going to be a slow burn. This is not something that's going to going to blow out easily. I'm feeling this is a blue flame. Okay. Mm, the magician. Definitely something that somebody was wanting to manifest. And like, I felt like this, this manifestation was definitely on hold with this four of coins, the hierophant, 10 of cups to the magician. This is something that somebody wanted to build, something that somebody wanted to create. And I feel like this was not going to come. This is 10 of cups, like 10 of cups is not going to come till you're ready. Okay. And no matter what capacity it is, it could be in love. It could be in friendships. It could be in community. But this definitely extends outside of yourself. Someone's manifestation extends um, out um, outside of themselves. And just meaning that the things that you are inspired by, the things that you're going to create, the thing that you're going to bring into existence is going to extend to a multitude of many different people is also what I'm hearing from this. Someone definitely has some form of um, very strong purpose. And I'm not even going to necessarily say um, it's divine. I feel like somebody's purpose is people. Your purpose is community. And like, I feel like you're going to be connected um, through a lot of people. This is definitely going to be physically. This is definitely going to be um, on, on, over the internet and in all forms of social media is also what I'm feeling. Okay. Somebody has some very big energy. What else spirit? With the emperor, somebody has some very big energy is that, <clears throat> excuse me, just what I said. Somebody here is, is a leader. Somebody here is a leader. I feel like you're just going to bring a whole lot to the world. That's going to connect, connect the dots, um, connect things together for a lot of people. I feel like through you, a lot of people also are going to see what leadership looks like as well. OK. You are also not what somebody expected. Emperor. With the hanged man and three of coins, it's almost like you are everything by yourself, especially with this hanged man to the three of coins. I feel like you're somebody people want to they people want to stay in your energy. People want to remain working with you. I feel like there are going to be a lot of people who want to work with you, who are going to want to attach themselves to you, collaborate with you. They want to remain and stay in your energy. I feel like somebody has a lot of um, a lot of knowledge to um, give to the world. There's a lot that you have to um, speak about. I feel like you you also are going to speak up about your experiences um, through life. Um, how you view life because of the things that you have gone through. But I feel like a lot of people that you are going to become connected to are going to be changed by this. I also feel like a lot of people are going to find this very attractive. I mean, it is the emperor. I feel like this emperor does at this present time, this is definitely giving me single energy. Like I feel at this present time, this emperor doesn't have an empress. And like, I feel like you are this. I mean, we do have the empress, you know, over here, but this is an energy that you shift through that, you know, how to bob and weave through, you know, the continuity, you know, the flow of this energy. So there's something definitely here um, that you use i feel like you also were meant to obtain something alone first 
This doesn't belong to somebody else. You're supposed to achieve something first. And this is for a specific few. You're supposed to achieve something first. And then your Ten of Cups will come into play. Okay. So Spirit, what is this Six of Coins to the Justice as far as a challenge? So Nine of Wands. Ten of Swords. Okay, I see why the challenge. As well as the Knight of Coins. One more Spirit. <laughs> yeah, so Queen of Swords. Um, definitely the challenge here um, seems to be um, some form of accepting of somebody's karma. I feel like this is something that you're definitely um, shielded off and blocked off to. Um, something that you're definitely watching, something that you're definitely um, definitely on guard about, especially with this Nine of Swords to this Ten of Swords. Um, endings happened here, especially with the Knight of Coins to um, the Queen of Swords. I feel like there's somebody who is reluctant to um, once again enter into your energy. As I said, judgment, justice kind of energy happening um, right now. I feel like somebody is very slow to approach. Not knowing when to approach this queen of this queen of swords, okay. I feel like um, also adversely, this is how you are coming as well. I feel like there's a shifting, and once again, there's a changing. I feel like you are who you need to be in every single moment. This Empress King of Wands energy, this Emperor Hierophant energy, and now also this Queen of Wands. You know, energy like I'm not even going to say you're the justice because that's not your thing. I don't feel like you're worried about that. I feel like you're just like you. You know, I don't know. For some reason, I'm just not getting. I'm not getting that you are the type of person who is quote unquote a revenge seeker. Okay, I feel like you are the type of person who waits for opportunities, and if you feel like there's anything that you need to say to that person, you'll say that to that person right then and there on the spot and in that moment. I feel like this is also adversely. Somebody who is wanting to approach you because they feel like they possibly are reaping some form of bad karma. I don't know what that karma is, you know, but I feel like they're po they feel like they're possibly, um, you know, reap reaping some form of bad karma. But I also feel like there is this sense of you su re um, supposed to look the way, look the other way, because how are you supposed to reap what you're getting if you're if you're worried about what somebody else is getting? You know what I mean? So let's see. Queen of Swords spirit. Yeah, Child of Swords, as well as the Seven of Coins. This is somebody who's watching you grow, <laughs> watching you expand, especially with the High Priestess. This is someone who has some knowledge or some awareness of about, you know, your development. They could possibly be watching you on, online, <laughs> as I said, through through any form of social media platform, including um, YouTube, if you have a channel. OK, I also feel like this is just somebody who honestly is is at this present time stuck. This is somebody who is blocked out of your energy with that nine of wands here. They are seeing you having some form of success, no matter what that is, whether you feel like you are or not. This is just the energy. They feel like at this present moment, you are successful, um, that you're possibly reaping some form of good karma, especially with this seven of coins. With the star. They see you shining, OK? OK. But it's not artificial like this is healing. This is growth. This is development. I feel like you've been enlightened by some form of experiences that you have gone through some form of darkness. I also feel like when light um, transfers from through you, whether it's bad, dark energy or whatever, I feel like it's changed. Because to become a, a connected to you, become attached to you is also to accept some form of change. Okay, Spirit, what is this strength as a possible outcome? Mm -hmm. Child of Wands, okay. Okay, 
So the judgment, <laughs> the chariot, the child of coins, as well as the house of God. There's divine order here, man. Child of wands, the judgment, the chariot, child of coins, as well as the house of God. Something here um, definitely is purposeful. Definitely is purposeful. Some sort of plan, some sort of action, some sort of inspiration, something that 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 you planned on, something that 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 has been in the work from what I'm hearing for quite a while is now being reawoken, like it's being awoken because now is the time for it to come forward, um, especially with this chariot to the page of coins it's coming to you as some form of, of 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 an offer something that is purposeful like it, it it's meant to happen especially with this house of god some form of change like i feel like there's some form of of abundance um here um something that's really meant to put you you into space because i feel like you you you've done your best to be upright not perfect you've made your mistakes but like i feel like your intention was to be upright I don't feel like you've been, you know, whoever this resonates with, I don't feel like you've been in some form of treacherous energy. I don't feel like you've been out here in the world just nasty and, and mean to each other. You know, I feel like you've just been in a space where you kind of like been minding your business, growing, developing. I'm trusting those nudges with this, um, with, with the high priestess showing herself earlier. But let's see, what's this house of God? So the death as well as the three of cups definitely changes. Um, I feel like many people are watching you watching this, seeing this happen. The six of wands was definitely at the bottom of the deck. So I definitely feel like there's somebody here who is definitely in some form of abundant energy. Um, something that you're doing in the present moment is gearing you up possibly for, for your future. Like all of these changes with the six of cups. This is something that I feel is coming back to you. Like, I feel like this is something that you always desired, um, something that you always thought about as well. But let's clarify and then we can get out of here. Three of Cups. Mm -hmm. This is a lot, but I'll take it. Yeah, so the five of um, five of coins. So a lot, a lot of individuals are being left out of this new start with the temperance as well to the full, the full and the temperance. Yeah, there's a lot of people in your energy who are who who were left out for a reason. They were left out in, left out of your energy. So 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 so, so that some sort of change um, can happen. And you remember I was speaking earlier about how you're able to change some sort of energy. We have the temperance here. Um, I feel like you're somebody who alchemizes change like you alchemize changing you're able to make it tangible in some sort of way so that you can use it you know to make your your goals your dreams your inspirations um happen and like i feel like that's just the energy that you're you know you're currently going to stay in <laughs> but let's see so that's it for the tarot you guys but let's see what the um the number two is in your dreams oracle okay okay so the number two, the number two is play. Um, it's fire and it's action. Let go of your biases. If you let go, excuse me, if you let your past go, it doesn't mean that your past will let you go. Okay. And then this is actually page um, 11. So I definitely feel like some some change is definitely approaching you some some rebalancing especially with the 11 being the justice you know i feel like enjoy is what i'm feeling like let all of this old stuff go with you seeming like you are i feel like you're just moving forward especially with this um six of swords being your present energy help is on the way and with that being said, Pisces Soul Tribe, um, hopefully this re reading resonated with you in some way, shape, form, or fashion, and you're able to take something from it that you can use. Pisces Soul Tribe, of course, if there's anything you need from me, you can find those details down below in the description box. 
And as always, Pisces Soul Drop, remember to conquer this day. Bye, guys.